Good morning! How are you, mate? How's it going on? Are you okay? Good. Well, at least I hope you're okay, bro. I'll give you some food in a minute. I have, uh, I've only ever been to a festival once, and this is what it looks like uh, so far. We're packing for uh, Creamfields Festival. Not sure if you guys have heard of it. It's a four-day festival that we're going to in the uh, next few days. But before I start this video, guys, thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring it. I really appreciate being sponsored by a company that I use for my actual business. So, guys, thank you. But look at all this stuff, man. I feel like I'm totally over-preparing for this, or much rather, we are totally over-preparing for this. Baby, let me down. Good boy. So guys, I really do want to go ahead and apologise about two things. Number one, this tweet in particular. I apologise about this. The video isn't out yet. I want to include one more thing in the video which I've had to buy and it just hasn't arrived yet and still hasn't arrived so the Ultimate Home Cinema won't be going out until I'm back from Creamfields. And the second thing is that in the last video I did, I said this. This huge plank of metal had fallen from the back of his trailer as a result of him leaving it open. Therefore, I drove over it, it made a big bang, and it's totally burst my tire. And I really need to sort that out today. Hey bro, have you finished your food? Did you enjoy it? But first, we need to go to the office. Bro, there is literally none left, my friend. Nothing, nada, finished, negative. So there's one thing that I absolutely love doing, it's opening parcels, that I have a hunch are full with tech. Wicked. We've got the Mavic 2 Pro with the Pro Controller. We've got a normal Mavic 2 Pro. I've got this to give away for you guys. So make sure you do manage to drop a like rating on this video and hit me up on my social medias. So at Marsbar Gaming on Twitter and at Marsbar on Instagram. Make sure you follow and then you are entered. So, best of luck to anybody that enters my little giveaway, and for me, well, uh, we've got a really busy day today. My grandma is helping me out, she's gonna cook me some lunch, I'm gonna go there and have that now, and at the same time, I'm gonna unbox my, yes, this one's for you guys, my new baby. Look how good the dog has been throughout my entire unboxing experience. Well, I, I, uh, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. So anyway, guys, it looks like I've got some unboxing to do later of a fair amount of stuff. Also, whilst I've been back, I've been messing around just a little bit with the gimbal. I would love to give you guys a little bit of a demonstration, but unfortunately, you see this flashing light? Well, oh no, it might do it. it well, it, it died earlier, essentially, but now I think it's got a last little bit of life. As you can see, everything should be super, super steady, but probably really, really ex overexposed. Anyway, enough talking about this. I spent far too long doing work in the office. We need to go and get these wheels sorted now. I'm like 100% so lucky that I didn't ever sell my Mini. I still have my Mini so I can still use that car. I do absolutely love the M2, don't get me wrong, but I've just had like so many problems with it. Quite annoying. This I'm coming straight to your eardrums. I'm coming straight to your eardrums. It's Mr. Unstoppable. Okay, so essentially these are the exact same dudes that did the wrap on the actual M2 itself. What I've actually asked them to do is put a sort of smoky tint on the rims, the original rims that came with the M2 competition. I think they're called like Y Spoke or something. You guys are probably saying, Alex, why? Why have you changed the colour of them? Well, I don't think the original rims would have fit the wrap of the car. I think it would have looked a little bit off. Hence why I bought the BBS rims in the first place. So let's go and see what they look like. I've got an Alexa on the wall with a bit of cable trunking. Alexa? <laughs> oh yeah, mate, that is absolutely mental. I prefer Mr. Unstoppable. And when I'm doing nothing, Mr. Impossible. I'm okay, so now with a car full of my brand new painted rims, I need to take them to the tyre garage so the tyre people can put the tyres on them and then these can go on my car. This is a really, 
really long process for something that was so, so stupid. 20 minutes later. Hello, mate, you all right? Yeah, mate, you? God, what are you doing? I'm here. Are you here to do what? I'm here to give it back. Oh, just give the thing back, okay. Do you want to cheers, mate? Yeah, cheers, mate. Okay, so I'm currently driving down uh, Luke's private road so I can tear it up a little bit. Like, woof! This thing is mental. Okay, wow. Golfer, there's Luke's golfer! Golf! Ah, oh, he's been golfing it! So I timed all of this quite well because I picked the car up from Tamvix and then the tool that I was meant to give back to Luke ages ago was just in the boot of this car. So I've driven it round straight away here and then I was going to talk about the car to you guys and I thought well, well I may as well do it in Luke's back garden because it's just the nicest, sort of the nicest place you can see around here and I've, I've just got access to it because Luke said I can film here so thanks Luke. So here you guys go, this is it. Um, a lot of you will think, what has changed? The rims have changed, yes, they are now the original rims that came with the car, except they look a hell of a lot different because they've sort of been powder coated gunmetal grey. Is it powder coated? It does feel powder coated, doesn't it? Regardless, I had these rims sat here and I wanted to use them because I didn't really want to buy another set of four rims and to be perfectly honest with you, I did like the BBS ones, but I just, there was just something about them. Do you know what I mean? I don't think they really suited me. But Luke, thank you for letting me uh, use your back garden and uh, I've now explained myself. Sweet thing guys, there we go. The car is all, uh, all home on the driveway. The actual car needs a bit of a clean itself. It was sat on my driveway. Hey, that door's not shut properly. That's mental. Let me know what you guys think of the rims and the wrap and the entire car and, well, Atlas. What do you think, bro? Regardless, guys, let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions. <laughs> few things this evening guys number one is see what the hell is in these parcels number two is take my little mo atlas for a walk and number three is to well tell you guys about today's vlog sponsor squarespace by the way quick side note we are currently sat in my brand new office as to which i'll be showing you guys a little bit more around soon a few little sneak peeks today maybe and squarespace is simply the best like all-in-one platform for making your website you can do things like i don't know choose from the millions of templates they've already got available and use the site editor and it's super super easy and pretty unique actually some of the designs are far out and they make it super super easy as well they've got 24 7 like round the clock customer service i get so many tweets saying alex how do you set up your own custom domain so you can have like your name.co.uk squarespace can set up your domain for you and yeah take all the heavy lifting off of actually making a website like squarespace do it all now if you use my link which will be in the top line of the description it will give you 10 percent off your first squarespace website or domain so please use it carefully it's a powerful tool me and tandem this me and tandem I prefer Mr. Unstoppable. Okay, so quite often I get a call from somebody that works in this office saying, Alex, you've got a whole load of parcels here and you haven't been here in a while. Can you come and collect them? And I'm like, hell yeah. But I got a call from someone that works at the office. Instead, what they said to me was, Alex, can you come and pick up this parcel from the office? Because it's absolutely massive. Now, as I've come in here and set up this camera this evening, I have seen the parcel. It is... I assume that is it. I assume that is what it is. And the most baffling part about this is that I have no idea what this is. Me and tandem, I prefer Mr. Unstoppable. Uh, hey, well, LG, guys, thanks for the soundbar. That's absolutely wicked. Thank you. 4.1.2 channel soundbar with Dolby Atmos. That is sick. And then I need to fit it in the car, and then I need to get it home. And because this thing is so big, that is going to be quite a stressful situation. So let me know down in the comments, guys, what you think we should do with this soundbar. But for now, guys, my name's Alex. You guys have been awesome, and I'll see you in my next upload. Adios. Me and Tandem, I prefer Mr. Unstoppable. And when I'm doing nothing, Mr. Impossible. I'ma lift a finger, put your mixtape in the hospital. Nurse coming closer just to witness all that I can do. 20 cc's of a double D's got me trying to clean.